The uh, Jean Doc Credit Union has been a major player in this neighborhood for many, many years. And joining us today is the Credit Union's uh, President and CEO, uh, Mark Corcoran, who has over 25 years experience in uh, financial services. Uh, John Doc Credit Union serves more than 50,000 members today and they're growing every day. And uh, we view the credit union as a very important neighbor, investor, and player in the further economic development of this, uh, of this neighborhood. So please welcome Mark Corcoran. Well, I too am uh, very excited to be here and be a part of all of this. But I got to tell you, about a week or two ago, Emily called me, who's uh, Marty's assistant, and said that Marty and Bernie Lynch would like to meet with you. And uh, I got a little nervous. I just got to be honest with you. I thought for sure they were going to make an offer on Tremont Yard and kick us out or do something. Uh, so this is great news. This is really exciting. Um, uh, Jean d'Arc Credit Union has been in this neighborhood for 99 years. We've been located on Merrimack Street the whole time. As was mentioned earlier, we're excited about the purchase of the Lowell Community Health Center building across the street from where we are, looking to expand the operation uh, right here in the acre, which we uh, really are a part of. We like to say at the Credit Union that we share a common thread, and we share a common thread with the hospital. Many of the uh, members of ours would enjoy the services of this hospital when it was in existence. Homer Bourgeois, who is one of my predecessors as CEO of the Credit Union, has a building named after him, if you notice on the front of the building. And um, our, our, meaning the Credit Union's administrative offices, were actually here for five years in the early part of 2000 to 2005. And so we certainly have this common thread or link to this neighborhood and to this building. At the same time, we have a common thread and link to the university. Um, we've done a lot together with them. We've enjoyed some of their faculty is on our board. Many of their students are our members. And uh, I gotta be honest with you, I'm a big Riverhawk fan and uh, we really support the athletics of the university as well. And so it's been a nice partnership and it's nice to see as we share a common thread that that thread gets broader and gets deeper and gets tighter uh, in the neighborhood and the task force for which we serve. So I'm personally excited to be on the task force with my friends on the dais and um, to help the development of this end of Merrimack Street, uh, which I think has great potential and possibilities over the next 10 years. So thank you for including me.